During the opening event for the Jewish Lawyers Association of Palm Beach County, the group's president said organizers were moved to create it after the deadly October 7th Hamas attack on Israel. And amazingly, after the biggest loss of Jewish life in one day since the Holocaust, we see a massive uptick in anti-Semitic statements, actions, and acts of violence. So a group of local lawyers came together and we decided we could do something. We could come together as Jewish lawyers and judges and allies and friends and make a difference. West Palm Beach Mayor Keith James spoke of his feelings of connection to the group's mission after his own visit to an Israeli kibbutz that was later attacked, killing more than 50 people, including children. I had the pleasure of traveling to Israel with a group of mayors. Uh, this trip was sponsored by the nonprofit American Jewish Committee. Uh, one of our stops was visiting a kibbutz near the Gaza Strip. Tragically, that very kibbutz, Kfar Aza, was one of the first attacked by the terrorists on October 7th. Mayor James, a Harvard-educated lawyer himself, vowed to support the organization's goals and asked for their support with similar issues. I need my Jewish brothers and sisters to stand with the African-American community during our time of need and oppression. I now live in a state where the history of my people cannot be taught. I live in a country where our fight against historical segregation is belittled as simply an effort to achieve DEI. Florida's Supreme Court Chief Justice said he's happy to see groups like this one forming to help each other and the community. I really, really, really appreciate groups like this. Um, that will work hard to create a culture where we really can as a society live up to the ideals that we all profess. The association says it aims to unite and represent not only the interest of Jewish attorneys but also their allies, as well as educating the public and fighting anti-Semitism in all forms. This is Cheryl Kahn reporting for WPB-TV.